We've all heard the increasingly used trendy term, the Internet of Things, and how game-changing it's going to be as we extend sensors, miniature sensors, into everyday objects. Everyday objects will start to give us real-time feedback, and the world essentially will come alive. This is the Internet of Things. But what if we evolved the term a little further? What if instead of the Internet of Things, we enter the realm of the intelligence of things? The intelligence of things is where the Internet of Things meets artificial intelligence because the future of artificial intelligence is senseless unless we extend it into the world of everyday objects. This idea that as we impregnate intelligence into the world of physical things that we inhabit, the world essentially will come alive. This real-time feedback, this interface that will become enlivened with intelligence will essentially create, will birth a world that will increasingly talk back to us. Now, how this will change human subjectivity, how this will change the human condition, the space of mind in which we dwell, is in the following way. Increasingly, we'll dovetail our minds to the world, right? And as the world starts talking back, the distinction between self and world will start to disappear. The external space, the external world, will increasingly start to feel like an extension of our mind, like an extension of our agency, which will bleed over into a world of predictability, a world that will know what we want before we want it, a world of serendipity, a world in which you look for something, you find something else, and you realize that what you found was more conducive to your needs than what you thought you were looking for. We're talking about a world optimized for human creativity and human enterprise, a world that is responsive, a world that is alive, a world that is intelligent, as I imagine, so it becomes comes and this is the very essence of magic. Now, you're pumping all this data, you're pumping all this AI into sensors, into the world of everyday objects, and again, you birth the world, the intelligence of things. The mind will have fully turned itself inside out. We will be inhabiting the condensation of human imagination. The nodes in our brain, the neurons will have spilled out into the world. We will cloak the planet in mind and data. This, my friends, is a singularity of mind and meaning. When everything becomes linked with everything else, matter becomes mind. This is the intelligence of things.